In a previous video, we filled a transit van full of fireworks and the health and safety conscious people in the comments said, Furs, what if that lot just all went off? Yeah, what would happen if that all just went off? So, this is the plan. Look, I've got my old plumbing van. He's still got half the stuff in it. We've got all my bean tins. Look, I used to keep all my fittings and bits and bobs in here. And then all my broom. I'll take that back, we don't want to burn that. Might need that in a bit. So, this is the experiment. We're going to fill all this with fireworks. We're going to shut the doors. We're not going to cut any of the door angles or anything like that. So, it's a genuine test of what would happen if a load of fireworks went up in the back of a van. So, let's get it all set up. Yes. Tidy. Now, of course, you would most likely want me to sit in there and test it, but I'm not doing that, so we've got this. Surrogate me, Trevor, who's going to sit in the transit? He's got his safety shirt and tie on, so I think he'll be fine. Here we are. You can have front seat on all the action, my friend. Put you there. <laughs> Nearly time. Just got time for a couple more. Down the road, not bad at all. Stop for a quick hit, hit hole in the wall. Try to vote, spin the largest flat. Oh, what about a singing? Love you, twat. Right, here we go. Got a bit of smoke coming in the cab. <laughs> not seen very good days. He's still recording though. Oh, yeah, that's working. We ain't opening that. comes a plane to land on. <laughs> oh, time ends impeccable. <laughs> uh, now we've just got the problem, of course, we've got a burning van at the end of a runway. We don't need to be able to put it out. It's all right, we've got the, uh, the air rescue service have turned up. Have you brought a bucket of water with you? No. <laughs> <laughs> We're all idiots round here! <laughs> well, it's definitely on 
fire now. Who would have thought that they weren't enough, mate? Eh? Unbelievable. driving down the A1 with a load of fireworks in the back of my van, I'd have to get out pretty quickly if they all started to go off. Now, we did take those ones out the boxes, which would have made a difference, but it normally takes about 40 seconds for them fireworks to cycle through all their shots. It definitely went off quicker than that, so they obviously all chain reactioned and set them all off in a big ball of madness. Now, a couple of things. We knew it would catch fire, but what I was hoping to do is open the doors, get the fire extinguishers in, kind of drag all the fireworks out and kind of extinguish it. But of course, it blew it up so much doors all got locked we could only unlock the front one and there's no way I was going to get in the back from there and there we are but the most surprising thing is we've managed to rescue the footage from all the cameras as you've probably worked out now this wasn't a GoPro this was a cheap 30 pound uh, god knows what it was called camera off eBay and believe it or not they've all survived too the ones on the roof the two inside it we've got them all back brilliant now, if you want to see some of my more planned firework experiments, click on some of the other videos. Thanks to Epic Fireworks for supplying the fireworks. And there we are. See you in the next video. Woohoo!